The Cotton Cup is Australia's oldest football knockout competition trophy, originally presented in 1907 to the New South Wales Football Association by Sir Harry Holdsworth Rawson, the 21st Governor of New South Wales. He considered himself an aficionado of the round ball game, and so the cup was originally named in his honour. The inaugural winner of the Rawson Cup was Piermont. Up until 1913, only the inner city teams of Sydney played for the cup, as these were working class areas filled with Anglo-Celtic football loving migrants. But Sydney had a second area that was also filled with Anglo-Celtic migrants, and who knew how to play the game of football very well. Out west in the Granville Clyde area was the cradle of the game in Australia. The nation's first football club was the Granville Magpies, founded in 1882, and they were a powerhouse of the game. Such was the strength of the Magpies that with the outbreak of the Great War, many of their players enlisted, and yet they were still strong enough to dominate in all competitions and became the first team to win the Rawson Cup for three consecutive years, 1914, 1915 and 1916. One such young man to enlist in 1915 was Private John William Cotton, who was a very popular striker of extreme note for the redoubtable Magpies. The Cotton family migrated from England in 1912 when John was 19 years old and lived in High Street, Harris Park. He joined the Magpies in 1914 after his incredible scoring talents with a local team caught the eye of the Magpies coach, and then he became their star striker. Sadly, he was killed in action serving his country. To honour the memory and to reward Granville for its success, the Rawson Cup was renamed and given to the Granville and District Soccer Football Association by the governing body. Engraved on the cup it reads, won outright by Granville and presented to the players of the GDFA for competition as the Cotton Memorial Charity Cup in memory of J.W. Cotton, killed in action in France April 17, 1917. For decades, the Cotton Cup was played only within the Granville Association boundaries. The Granville Magpies have won it 10 times, but it is the Granville Waratah Soccer Football Club that has won the Cup the most with 12 titles. But more about that in a moment. Last year, we celebrated the centenary of the renaming of the Cup, and the Junius FA invited teams from outside of the Granville Association to contest the Cup and make history. Starting with 32 teams from around Sydney, it was Auburn FC, who was victorious scoring their inaugural cup title. And to commemorate the centenary, each player also received an exact replica of John Cotton's 1915 gold medal, the last football award he received before enlisting. Hi, I'm Noel Dona, and I'm the president of the mighty Granville Waratah Soccer Football Club. We will have a team in this year's Cotton Cup because we're shooting for our 13th title. So if you think you've got what it takes to win the Cotton Cup, proudly sponsored by my game guru, then I invite you to enter and see if you can take our record.